right here and there's a mail opening this is the uh, coin if I'm correct and uh, this came last week but I forgot about it <clears throat> so let's see this is the next decimal crown collection uh, struck by the Royal Mint in 1981. This Copernical coin was issued to commemorate the marriage of Prince Charles to Lady Diana Spencer in July 1981. Features conjoined portraits of Charles and Diana comes with certificates. So that was £12.50 and £2.99 postage and packaging. Yeah. And obviously other you know, adverts on the inside. That going. Mm. Huh. Well, I guess they didn't put this. Hmm. They did put it in, so I guess I have a spare. Maybe. Hang on a minute. Yeah. For some reason, the gave me a spare coin case. Plastic coin case. Oh, it's always useful, I guess. And obviously, the uh, presentation case uh, ads. And that ad there. Same as always. Uh, let's see. It says enclosed is your 15 pound discount voucher. So what? Well, they've got an ad picture for this. It does look pretty cool. Uh, discount voucher enclosed it's for the original 1953 coronation crown. I'm not going to get this one. So, by all means, you can take the code or whatever. Um, okay, all you need to do this is for this is for this. I right, want a bigger picture. Alright, this is. 15 pounds off or something for this coin, original 1953 coronation crown, for just 14.99. What you have to do is go to there, westminsterorders.com forward slash 216102E0, or 
call the 0333-0032-777. Oh, you can't do that because you don't have the envelope. But, um, you'll receive it a few days. And there's two pound ninety nine postage and packaging. You have to read this bit, it's important because this is part of the collection. The rest of the coins will cost ninety-five pounds plus three pound ninety-nine position packaging. And you can return. So this is the order reference, as I said before, two one six one zero two E zero. So type that in after the forward slash here get it. And within the next seven days, the next week or so, if it's still there, then take it if you want it. So, yes. so that will be going in the cycle. I'm not really interested in this one. Though it is very nice design at the back though. But yeah. I'll keep the picture though. The picture's nice. Anyway, on to the actual coin. Um, paper. Uh, a certificate of authenticity. Yes. So this is part of the Crown Collection. I actually haven't got this in the post for a while. So it's behind. Anyway. To celebrate the wedding of the Prince of Wales to Lady Diana Spencer in 1981, the Royal Mint issued a commemorative crown. This was the last crown coin to be released with a 25 pence face value. Although no denomination was inscribed on the coin, from 1990 the crown was received or was revived as the commemorative five pound coin, and these coins are marked with their value. In a first for British coinage, three people have been portrayed on this coin, and it is the first coin to bear Diana's portrait. The, the obverse features uh, Arnold Mackin's portrait of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, while the reverse designed by Philip Nathan of Her Majesty Queen uh, well, I can't read, shows the conjoined profile portraits of Prince Charles and Lady Diana with their names around the coin's circumference and the year date at the foot. So the spe specs. Very nice certificate thing anyway too. But here is the coin. So let's go for this one first, so there's Queens of the Seconds. Can't really get a good reflection on that very well. But anyway, here. If you see. HRH. I guess he's Royal Highness. I think, if I'm right. The Prince of Wales and Lady Diana Spencer. 
1981. Yeah, so that is what this is. I'll get around to putting it away. <laughs> it's, I'll put it with... Well, I left the, the case out on my desk. I just need to find it. Anyway, so thank you for watching. I'd like to try for more. Over and out.